Hi, Brooke. We've been talking about health and fitness and exercise this morning. I wanted to go a little bit deeper, if we could. Okay. Would you be able to tell me about, not your best day or your, your worst day, but a typical kind of day of eating and exercise for you? Well, I'm getting better at eating breakfast, which is a problem for me because I don't usually... I will, I'm the sort of person that will just have tea or coffee in the morning and then won't really... And, like, I'll pick all day long. And since I started working with this trainer, he said that sort of, you know, I would go, I would eat my biggest meal at night, yes. you know, because that's, and then I would have wine and I would eat my biggest meal and, it, you know, I wouldn't, I'd go to sleep with a full stomach and just a, you know, relaxed attitude. <laughs> um, and that evidently isn't the healthiest way. So um, <laughs> he said I needed to go like that. <laughs> start off with the biggest meal. So I've been practicing that. I've been trying to sort of force myself to eat my biggest meal in the morning. Um, I always work out, and I usually work out in the morning. I have to usually start my day, because if I don't get it in in the morning, then I usually will, it'll be harder in the day. Um, and then I, I don't really eat a lot of food, but I think alcohol is probably my worst problem. And not... <laughs> It's true. Um, and I've recently um, stopped for long periods of time and I'm so happy with the way I feel <laughs> um, that it's, you know, it's encouraging me to not drink. And um, so that, like, that, was, that was sort of a big change for me. Um, I eat really well because I like good foods. Um, you know, and I think that, but I work out um, four or five times a week. I will give myself one or two days, two days rest. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you.